Hey guys, welcome to Hardcore Harry Plays Some Shit. I'm Hardcore Harry, and this is some shit. The shit we're playing today is a little game called The Magic Circle. It's a game where you take control of a character from inside the game, and your goal is to finish creating the game because the developer isn't doing it. Um, the reason I picked it, I figured it's a good first game, is because in the trailer one of the lines is, I'm going to finish it because he's never going to call it done, which is kind of where I'm at with YouTube right now. I keep calling it not perfect, not done, so I figured this is a good game to start with, and it should be good inspiration. So, let's get into it. New game. My old man used to take off his wedding ring and sort of flick it into a spin. I remember being scared to blink, like, what if he loses it? Would he lose mom? Would he lose me? So that's our cold open. Just a ring twirling over black. Will it stand or fall? And then, as Starfather, I speak once. Starfather stood alone before the circle. Within it, he placed everything. First breath, final gasp, love, loathing, you. By his will, circle became ring. By his hand, earth parted from sky. But even he could not foresee the coming of Ava Nadir. Okay, I'm trying to record here, and you're making that face again. The player can skip this, right? Oh, yes. The story is only my life's work, but Sounds by all like means, me. skip to the last page. Shall I leave it blank, so you have somewhere to doodle? Ish, you were married, right? You and your wife ever dress up? You know, role play. Maze. Thought so. And in that little <laughs> scene, did you all find yourselves in burning need of a narrator? No. The meaning lives and dies in the act. Someone's never been in love. It's just a game. Shut up and let them play. Ah, uh, people, just use this take for now. I'll redo it tomorrow. Uh, we end on Through the Ring, and Fade Up is the Hero Awakens. All right, let's see. Left shift is control. Okay, mouse controls the view. F for use. All black and white. We got some color to this world. Ten. Guys, I can't put any looter optional story in here until you approve it. Tell me how you really feel. Just jump, shift, zooms. Is there like a run button? Alright. Wow, this shit's all on fire. Some arrows. This is a nice battle here. Let's see if we can find ourselves. Is there a door here or is the fire blocking the door there? Hey, it looks like it. Man, I could die. Fuck it. Ah! Oh. Alrighty then. Oh, wait, let's see. Huh. <laughs> that really isn't finished. This is gonna be cool as fuck. I don't wanna go that big building yet. That's obviously where I'm supposed to go. Yeah, this lad the impaler action going on here. The other houses I can try to get into. Kinda jump up here a little bit. Anything in here? Oh, another dead person. Beep beep. Yeah. Is there a door here I can get in? Temp. We cut side quests, right? What goes here now? Do some voices. Temp. Villager. We could have a conversation here if someone would finish the script. I'm going to finish the fucking script. I got this. Don't worry, guys. Who's this? Is that my sword? Mom, father's sword. My father? No, father to us all. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's time to do some damage. Oh, please. Oh. So, who are you? A new playtester? What? Well, let me save you some time. Today... I push the buttons. Ish, we are not changing this part again. Twenty years, Maze. 
shit. 20 years I've wasted writing about the almighty player. Well, who is the player anyway? They're like Dr. Me, Jekyll bitch. and Mr. Genocide. They oh. demand a world full of deep, compelling characters, yet at any time, they reserve the right to turn said people into piles of gently glowing ash. Well, but what possible story could survive these conditions? It's a murder mystery now? Hmm. Everyone's dead. Who could do such a thing? Oh yeah, me. Look! Look at our hero. A lonely mute who can't even lower their killing hand. Matricide is just how they say hi. Your story needs mom to live, so I have to cut all weapons out of the game? Negative. Fire no. me. Never. Sorry, bro. Long story. No choice. Uh, but I want the sword. Oh. Uh, but I want the sword. Really? Alright, what else can I take All here? Right. What was next? Next was giving my sword back so I could kill somebody. May, shall we continue? Okay. I just want a weapon. I just want to do some damage. Now, we don't have any animations yet, but I can make do. Oh. Hero, the demoness, Ava Nadir, has stolen my ring. She alone now commands life and death. So I need a weapon. Ish. The company is broke. The last kickbacker campaign raised less money than that joke fund demanding to have you cane by the state. That was you trying to get fired. Even now, I struggle to hold the sky aloft. Never proven. Point is, we can't raise a penny nope. more without nope, a nothing live upskirt. gameplay demo. No. Yes, I'm the Gotta have penis. We speak. Wit must be your sword, and virtue your shield. Yes, now give me the weapons back. Hero. Take back the circle. You, who seems reasonable, give me my weapons. Ah, oh, whatever. Yeah, let's see what's back here. Oh, the music's picked up. Hell yeah. No, that song is better for a boss fight. What else do we have? Yeah. Get in there. Oh, look at that. I want to go there. I want a weapon first, though. I'll take a weapon. Don't worry, I'm getting a weapon. I'm getting a goddamn weapon. Mysterious. But this is the ending. Sadder, maybe. Can you pick the goddamn music? It's my turn to pick the music. What's this? Change log. Eric Last, Lee, Lee level designer. Escape. I don't know which of your artists did it, but putting the elementary lock way, uh, way above the door means that like 110% of testers just spin in place, clutching the keys, looking for a hole, and cursing the game's designers. I have news for you. All the glorious detail you put in the treetops, vaulted ceilings, not a mortal soul has ever seen them. Repeat after me. The player never, ever, ever looks up. Fix it. I look up sometimes. Let's pick this one. Ice Peaks quest status incomplete. For now, just cheat and spawn Ice Key. Oh, okay. Easy enough. Carried objects can be thrown. Hold F to aim your throw. Release to throw. Boom! Cloud Realm quest status incomplete. Same deal, spawn air key. Boom, bitch. Same deal here. Volcano quest ass and complete. Same deal, spawn fire king. Spawn the fire key. None shall pass. Bitch, I'm passing all this shit without even doing it. Life jungle quest status and complete. Same deal, spawn life key. Let's do this shit. Fucking break this gate down. Damn and right. Eight to twelve it. hours later. No. Oh. I am Ava Nadir. Then we release the Hellhounds. Oh, wait, but we just cracked combat. So uh, we? 
Oh no. I'm deleting the end game bridge so the team knows we're blocked by your decision. I want to ship this thing. That's the contract I signed. You stole 10 years of my life. We don't own True. you. Just the rights to your celebrity name and face. And if you yeah. quit, I use it like so. My real name is Maze Evelyn. Once I was a hotshot pro gamer, but now I teach yoga. I'm also legally married to a crystal formation. You're holding my oh. brand hostage? Okay, ish. Okay. I'll stay on until the end. Wait that? till I tell you my new idea for the end game. Threats don't sink in anymore, Maze. Try reading some of my fan mail. Now I need to review the final cinematic alone. Thank you. Just give my weapons back. Give me weapons. Avanadir, hero, you are trapped. My minions will destroy you. They probably will. I don't have any weapons. So, uh, uh, run away. Yeah, I designed that fight to be hard, not unwinnable. But with no weapons, it might as well be a ugh cutscene. Thanks yes, for friends. Fish. But there's a bug I haven't fixed. Your body was erased, but it hangs around. Taking a memory. You can still move if you want to finish testing. Oh, oh, I like this girl. Later, bitches. You have been deleted, just like Mad Artie, aka Ghosted. While Ghosted, you can interact with other ghostly objects. Uh, let's see. That is creepy. What the hell is that? If I could turn back time. Well, the game saved good. Game saved me dead. Even weaponless, the champion defeated Nadir. For they had selflessly offered up their firstborn son to Starfather. To become a new god. I like it. Ah, hello. Uh, Coda, right? Mesa's community intern. Why are you here? Love, sir. Your work is the great love of my life. Uh, Coda. Don't panic. I won't ask you to sign any body parts. <laughs> but I have literally grown up waiting for the sequel, and I will help finish it. Did you rehearse this? Many times, but hear me out. It might interest you to know that you make video games for a living. That should be an act of love. But after 20 years, True. well, love is not some mystic, inexhaustible force. It's a fuel. Projects oh. like this run on it. And so, with respect, your tank is dry. You think I sound young, but purpose trumps experience, and you know it. This the rest demo, team names. I won't sleep until it's perfect. The magic circle has come too far to run empty now. It will reach everyone. And if necessary, sir, I'll burn for it. Coda? Shit. Ignore whatever Maze told you. Now you're hired. Shit. Let me guess. You're thinking, that's it? Did I miss the punchline? And you're right, boss. This world is a joke. We're gonna I make it not a joke. It. Oh, I'll finish it. Pro mode. All right, guys, I'm going to wrap it up there. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. And drop me a like and hopefully no dislikes. Next episode, tune in to see what happens to our intrepid hero, Hardcore Harry, and what pro mode holds in store for him. Will he finish the game? Will he break the game? Will the game break him? Find out the answer to these questions and more in the next episode of Hardcore Harry Plays the Magic Circle.